I was not feeling good um, a couple weeks ago. And um, I hadn't made much. Um, I hadn't made much on YouTube. And I had been just feeling down and sick. I had a cold and my throat was all itchy. And, you know, all that nasty stuff that comes along with the cold. I just was not feeling like myself. And I wanted to, like, sit back and watch somebody else just build and just enjoy vicariously building through someone else and I posted something on the black summer and my girl she was like if you don't get up and build something <laughs> and I was like oh she's so right I really want to build and I do that sometimes when I like want to build I will actually sit and watch other people build it's it's very odd i mean obviously i'm already weird that that just it just makes me even weirder like i really will sit and watch somebody else play the game when i want to play the game which i don't know why i just do that and she said that and i was like you know what she right <laughs> i need to go play the game i need to go build something in the game and i'll feel better and i did like so this this started out the first part if you haven't watched the first part man stop go back give that exterior a little bit of love because <laughs> it was it was definitely um not it wasn't it was like the exterior was something i was like oh if i do a spa i have to build it all myself this is not i i, I like small builds but couldn't take somebody else's build and I couldn't just make a room like this needed to have the entire essence be mine in order for this to turn out the way I wanted it to so I had to like give it a little bit of love and I'm like well how am I going to record this if and you'll notice if you watch all the parts how I build I'm like I don't know how I'm going to record this because I'm not a sectioned builder essentially I will build here and then there and then here and there and this build I knew was going to be such a long um, process for me I really was trying to segregate it in a way that I could showcase it and um, so I decided to go with the exterior I was like let's do the exterior it's gonna be painful and this might not even be the finished product but let's just try it and I did I tried, I tried building the exterior and then I just got so inspired I kept going and I started to do this this um, entrance um, area that you're watching now. And in this this area, just this is where this is where like I just started to get super excited. I was like, okay, okay, I'm feeling it, I'm feeling it, I'm feeling, it, I'm feeling it so much more. And everything just started to kind of come together into this beautiful arrangement. And telling y'all I'm not even trying to like to my own horn but I love uh, this build and I did something really unique with this build I actually um lent it to a friend Lena Sims um, you probably remember her I challenged her in my interior takedown um and she, I actually packaged this up several different times actually and sent this to her and said hey like can you put this in your game she does some amazing role plays on um, Instagram, one of the families and the real Mr. Smith, fine. Okay, like a fine Sam, like for real fine. And um, yeah, I asked her, I was like, can you, can you put your Sims in here and you know, play test it and then take some pictures. And oh, MG, the pictures, the like life that this, 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 this build, this static building just came to life with her sims in there and like it just fit them so perfectly and i just i cannot wait you guys if y'all download this and please do because it took me a lot of stress to make sure you had every file that you needed so please go download it <laughs> so i can feel like i did something and i gave something to you like i please please go download this and then tag me Tag me if you're going to post the Black Simmer. Tag me if you're going to post on Twitter. It's Honeybee Sim on Twitter. So Instagram is uh, Honeybee Sims on Instagram or Honey Brown YT. I'm not sure. I probably should change that, but that's a whole nother problem. Tag me. Find me. All, all my links 
to my social media is down in the description below find it tag me i want to see your sims on this lot like it brought me so much joy like i can't even explain how happy i was to see the the model through some other person's eyes like seeing how lena interacted and how her sims interact in a model it just was like oh, this spot is it's just gorgeous like it just it just bring it to a whole nother level and i just fell in love with it like all over again so yeah if you are going to download this and you're going to i don't care if you just get your toes rubbed like take a picture tag me in it like let me see you guys playing with this because i'm so happy to give this lot to you guys because i know we all feel like del so valley is um lacking in things to do and places um to build um or even places to see so um by all means you know if you want to put this in another world it's named after oasis so it's definitely gonna be in my in my in my game on in oasis as well but yeah tag me man this is just this is like the perfect celebrity spot like it just really fits the celebrity life the only thing I, I think there is a mod out there I don't think I need to get it because when I was play testing it it was like a lot of um paparazzi on the lot and I was like I really want it to be a celebrity lot without paparazzi and I've noticed like some other gamers when they're playing they like will have um the paparazzi um a trait or turn on a trade or turn off a trade or something and the paparazzi won't come and so I need to figure that out because the way the traits are set up right now the paparazzi show up and I don't really like that aspect but everything else is gold it's gold it's so gold so what you're seeing right now is me kind of finalizing the look of the interior this is kind of like my first attempt at the overall scheme that I was going to have throughout the spa and really in, it ended up being the overall feeling instead of the overall scheme I, I wanted it to feel clean and crisp and like refreshing but I also wanted it to feel expensive and um, beautiful like designed but not so upscale that it was out of reach but not not like your average spot either so I kind of wanted to feel a little real and feel a little attainable but also feel elegant there is going to be when you if you continue watching um the next video that will come out after this there's going to be um some what i like to call fit out space for my construction background is <laughs> some fit out space some basically some empty space in the basement area that you would be able to add to um build in and kind of expand on what maybe you didn't get and if you do that please like comment on this video and be like hey you know um I uh I uh added this or I decided to you know expand and add, add this to the, to the basement area I would love to see it and I would love to know what your thoughts are and what kind of what vision you you seen it in um when you get done overall this build will have two massage rooms one for a single and one for a um couple massage it has a steam room which is everything like i love the steam room the best like i feel like the sims navigate to this um steam room when playing just normal play they love the steam room um it does function as a spa so there is staff they are waiting to give you a hand foot or back massage um the pool area is so beautiful and that is in the basement so that'll be in the next video and um there's a workout center so basically I took away the workout center that was originally on this lot. There was a workout um, facility, I can't think what it was called, it was like Pectorial Fitness I think. Yeah, it was Pectorial Fitness. Ugh. It was it was basic, you know. So I made it fabulous. <laughs> and now you have you still have a place for your sim to go work out and you don't have to be a celebrity to come here so anybody can come. Um, but I did make it a celebrity hangout spot so that if you have celebs in your game, you're more than likely going to see them on this lot. And um, 
outside of the two massage rooms, the steam room, the fitness center, and the pool, there is two role play rooms. So my goal was to make this like Sims playable and role play um, fitting. Like I wanted to appeal to both the Sim player and the role player. And so there's two rooms in the basement that would be more for a role player. They don't function as a actual um, anything. But um, you'll see those in the next video. Those will be, um, I like to call them like the liposuction room or like the, um, what am I looking for? The word, it's um, like a procedure room, like a procedure room. If you were going to get like, I don't know, like a facial or you were going to get like actual, you know, liposuction or you want to like make your lips bigger. Or you wanted to like, you know, bring your brow up or whatever. Tuck, nip, snip you know you want to do that would be the room um but that's the only thing i think that is not playable in this lot outside of that there is a yoga studio there is a beauty salon that if you're not aware beauty salons are not playable um unless you put in a mod for a beauty salon um, but yeah, it won't be playable, but it will be great for role players. But there is a nail tech. I like to call the nail tech area. It's in the beauty salon, but it's really like the hand and foot massage. So if you're thinking your sin's going to go there and get like an actual Medicare, I'm sorry, but that is not how it works. But you can pretend that they're getting a manicure and then have them sit at the little nail drying station. Or you can just, you know, let them get a hand massage and move on. There's also a bar. Unfortunately, the bar doesn't have a bartender at the moment, but you can hire a bartender if you're playing um, and then like maybe reimburse yourself the money back because actually he should have already been there. But um, that is the only few things I think I can think of. Oh, there's one more thing that is not playable and that is the sinks in the um, locker room. So that's the play versus the non-play um to recap everything works except for the sinks in the bathroom and you could change those if you really really want the sink to be playable you just need to lower it the way i have it raised is for beauty and not function but there's tons of sinks in this place if they really really have to go wash their hands and the shower doesn't get their you know hygiene up they can go in the kitchenette they can go in the bathrooms they can go anywhere else because i needed that to look a1 and so it does um and then the obviously the beauty bar the beauty technique or the the um the beauty salon is not necessarily playable unless you have the mod by Kawhi stacy i believe i'll link that mod in the description below i gotta find it but and you would need that mod if you wanted to play with the beauty salon and i'm not really sure how it works because i haven't played it so sorry i can't really help with the details on how that will work plan on getting it but you guys see i spend most of my time building i always say like i want to play i want to play and then guess what i don't ever play so i'm thinking that maybe i should start a role play because that would like force me to have to play the game and it would give me a reason to take pictures of the lots I build. And it would give me a reason to build more things. So it might work all the way out. Because I would have a sim. And I have to do all this stuff with it. In order to take pictures. Right? So that might be coming soon in the future. Just because I really want to play the game. And I never actually get to. Unless I'm playtesting. And that's only for like an hour or two. Out of the days and days and days. In which I had like spin and build mode. Um, so yeah, right here we are building, um, out the couple's massage room and I was trying to make this a romantic, I didn't want it to be overly dark. I didn't want it to be overly light space, kind of relaxing and quiet without the need of you actually turning the lights off. You just kind of walk in and lay down and you would go rest it and rejuvenate it. And then I wanted the bamboo kind of feel to be like you know back in the background um and yeah i wanted to be a couple space so that you could have like your girls like if it's just you and a girl um well not to say 
there's no guys watching so let me include you guys too say it's you and your girlfriend or it's two girls you know you and your girlfriends hanging out your boo whatever you can have a couple space there's also a single space if you wanted to just um grab a massage alone and then um there's also the fitness center and the yoga studio and a plenty of other stuff to do if you have like a whole girl's trip here. Because I thought about that too. I was like, how many people are going to want to do a girl's trip to a spa? Because I know that would be me. Like, I'm always trying down to go to a spa with my girls. Like, how many want to go? You know what I mean? Let's all go. But I wanted to at least have that couple aspect because I, you know, I love taking my girls to the spa and then we get like a little massage next to other and we like you know gossip and talk and chill while we're getting you know rubbed on real good so unfortunately i can't control who works here under the way the circumstances are because i wanted to have a guy and a girl in the massage rooms and not just like you know one or the other that way if there was a dude he could have like a girl like working her out so you know what i mean you have to like working him out rather but you'll have to like play with that a little bit um and see how it works oh you get a little bit of glimpse of the bathroom so um another point is this bathroom is not um videotaped yeah so i was struggling with the layout of this um locker room bathroom area and i just turned off the camera and it came to me it also it was just like i don't know i was i was I was struggling, I was going back and forth with the layout. I have these big sculptures that were in the way and it was just like not working out, not feeling right, it was taking too long and I was redoing the same part over and over so I ended up not recording that. But in the photos you'll see at the end, it came out perfectly. The locker room, there's actual lockers so the sim can actually walk up to the locker and change. There's these panels that will actually um, trigger the sim to change. And there is um, two functional showers. And I think some of this, like one, so there's a shower room. The shower room's just like open. Um, so your sim has to be like, you know, no shame in that game because there is no like privacy in the shower. But I thought that was still really cute and sexy. Like, you know, if you needed a shower, normally you probably don't want in there anyway but it's still open it has that kind of like communal feel i took this idea and ran with it like so dijana she had a old build i want to say it was like a bachelor pad um and that's her majesty builds on um tumblr she had this cute shower and she used the pivoting doors in the shower to create this um like glass effect and it was everything everything so i took that kind of idea and i made it and applied it to the locker room because i thought it just fit it just went with it and then i also used that same technique for the steam area which just kind of took that steam room to the next level like it was just a room and now it's like everything and um, it all ended up working out really, really, really well. So I'm going to also link Her Majesty Bills in the description below. If you are looking for some celebrity homes, I got you. You got to go to her Tumblr and you check it out. You're going to be like, oh, this is exactly what they should have put in Delso Valley to begin with. You know what I mean? That's exactly how you're going to feel after you see her shit. So it's all good. Um, Shouts out to Lena. Thank you for the pictures, girl. These pictures are everything. I like look at the pictures as if i didn't even build it and i just get happy all over again like thank you thank you thank you thank you girl thank you and um what else i don't know i think i've been talking long enough and if you guys like please hit that like button if you would go ahead and subscribe to the channel so you can be updated when the download drops you know what i mean you guys to get the download right <laughs> next video Thank you guys for your support. I appreciate you so much. And let me know what you need in your game because I am looking for ideas. I have a long laundry list of things to do, but I'm trying to uh, get to it all because it all inspires me. Thank you guys. Peace.
comment, and subscribe. And follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Snapchat.